Hi. Hey guys, <laughs> Matthew's family checking in. We want to give you guys an update on our family and our ministry and also South Africa. This little one turns one in a couple of weeks, which is exciting. Um, there's also several things that need to happen in order for us to leave to go to South Africa. Two big ones off the top is South Africa as a country has to allow international travel. And so the second one is crew, the ministry we work for with Athletes in Action also has to allow us to go. So we're waiting on an update July 1st. Um, we're waiting on an update from crew to know what that specific date will be and whether we'll be pushed back past August. And so we're working on the rest of the things we have to get done in order to go. Uh, we have to get our immunizations. We have to finalize our will. We also have to get our visas. It's a long, detailed process. We have to get our house ready to rent. We also have to find renters, pack up our stuff, put it in storage, and also learn about the ministry and the culture that we're going to be going into. And lastly, we have to finish raising uh, the support we need in order to go. We've seen one third of what we need to go come in already. Praise God. Yeah, and thankfully during this time, uh, we've been able to continue some of our online Bible studies with the student athletes at NC State through Zoom, which, been, which has been a huge blessing. And, you know, I think that when we made the decision to go to South Africa, you know, there were 10 cases of COVID in the United States at the time. and. It was one of the biggest steps of faith that I've taken, that we've taken together as a family. And, um, you know, but it's also one of the most, you know, uncertain, unprecedented times of our lives. I can imagine of your life too. But we know that it's not a coincidence. We know that God is sovereign. He's all knowing. He knew that this is what the world was going to look like um, in the months following us leading to go. So, we just, we're continuing to trust him and trust in his plans for our life. <laughs> um, but we wanted, to, we wanted to update you guys. And please, please let us know how we can be praying for you. Um, we're grateful for your love. We're grateful for your support. And we cannot do what we're doing without you. We're going to uh, add some prayer requests to the screen here at the end of this video. We'd really appreciate your prayers um, during this time. We have some specific ways you could be praying for us. So. We appreciate you guys. We look forward to hearing from you and talking with you soon. Love y'all. Bye, guys. Say bye-bye. Bye. Say bye, Shelby. Bye-bye.